Open RAN is just about the hottest topic in mobile networking right now. So I'm talking to Petra Ledl, VP, Head of Network Trials and Integration Lab at Deutsche Telekom about this really important topic. So Petra, how do you see the impact of general purpose compute platforms in the Open RAN ecosystem? How important are these platforms? Yes, no, I think uh, first of all, um, open, uh, open RAN itself uh, creates an opportunity to, uh, to really um, uh, disaggregate uh, RAN solutions and then take best of breed components and put them together. And here, uh, general purpose compute platforms uh, represents a large uh, part of a solution um, that is replacing the today's uh, custom built hardware that is used with tightly integrated software and replacing that um, that compute platform and allowing um, uh, allowing to run uh, radio access network software workloads on top of that uh, compute platform. So from that perspective, it really um, enables to introduce new vendors and introduce new competition on, on, on that horizontal layer, as it is really decoupling, um, decoupling a hardware uh, and software, and that allows to decouple uh, development cycles and lifecycle management of the solutions in the, in the software layer and in the, in the hardware, hardware layer. So, uh, so in order to achieve uh, higher diversity of uh, of contributors and also faster innovation in in, in run space, it it is really a significant opportunity. But at the same time, it is also bringing uh, new challenges, and and these are really ranging from how do we solve the problem of hardware acceleration or how do we manage the uh, complex interoperability scenarios when we are aggregating uh, the solution back. So, um, so uh, we need to work on these issues so that uh, the solutions based on general purpose compute platform are equivalent to, uh, to today's RAN solutions. And how important is the work of the ORAN Alliance to telcos and the rest of the open RAN community? Yes. So, uh, in general, for uh, for Deutsche Telekom, for Deutsche Telekom, and I believe also for and um, other major uh, network operators, global uh, global standards are essential enabler for uh, for mobile networks, and um, they enable uh, economy of scale because it allows uh, components uh, of the networks to be efficiently integrated uh, and also allows really companies to focus on um, a particular components uh, of the solution. So Oran Alliance uh, is the key enabler in order to provide the aligned, uh, globally aligned architecture blueprints and principles, interfaces, specifications, and uh, related uh, solutions in order the ecosystem is able to efficiently develop uh, components of uh, disaggregated RAN solutions. And how can an infrastructure provider like HPE participate in the ORAN Alliance in a way that would help Deutsche Telekom and other operators roll out their 5G networks? I think uh, here contributors like uh, HPE are essential in, uh, in helping us uh, to, to manage complexity uh, related to um, uh, aggregating uh, system components uh, back together. So uh, by bringing um, VRAN blueprints um, and reference designs, as well as uh, how, do we, uh, how do we manage uh, uh, these infrastructures uh, via, uh, via SMO and orchestration frameworks and how do we um, how do we define interfaces uh, between those uh, those those layers? Uh, their contribution is is critical for the success of uh, of the whole open run uh, solutions. Great. Well, Petra, it's been great talking to you uh, today about open run. Very important topic for the whole industry. Thanks very much. 
Thank you.